Hey guys, Toolman Tim here. Welcome back to the workshop where we build business, create community, find freedom, and share success. It's time for another Toolbox Tuesday, and we've got a really cool product this week. A headlamp made by Coast, which seems to be a brand that you can get at most stores. Um, it's priced you know, in the higher end of what you would normally consider a, a decent headlamp, but it kind of blew me out of the water. And remember real quick that Toolbox Tuesday is a Float Original Series so that you can catch, catch my videos on all my platforms, but this one is originally inspired by Float.app, F-L-O-T-E dot A-P-P, that's a social media platform that I use a lot. It's decentralized. They're in favor of minimal to no censorship. So if you got a minute, go by, check it out, and add me, Toolman Tim, as a user, and see what it's all about. Hang in there. We'll be right back. All right, guys, real quick, you know what this is all about. But uh, if you're looking to buy any of the products that I feature in my reviews, the link will be in the description below. It's an Amazon affiliate link. So if you end up buying it or anything from Amazon in the next 24 hours, I'll get a small commission. So thank you very much. And don't forget to drop by toolmantim.co. That's toolmantim.co. Find out all about my social media platforms, my different uh, content creation outlets, and sign up for my monthly newsletter if you're interested. Okay guys, so like I said, this Toolbox Tuesday is a fairly new series that we're getting into, but so just so you get the hang of it, there'll be a little shorter reviews than my normal tool time on Thursday. And they could be anything from tools, hand tools, to accessories, to preparedness items, to regular around the house stuff that can just make your life a little bit better. So this week, Following on the heels of my weekend workshop video where I broke down the lessons I learned from the power outage with my generator, I wanted to talk about how handy this little headlamp is. Now, I had it sitting for quite a while and when the power went out the other day, I needed the headlamp and I normally keep it in my end table and one of my after incident lessons that I wrote down and let people know was that I need to get more headlamps because this thing is awesome. I've got a DeWalt one that's still in the package. I haven't tested it out yet, but we will before too long. Now, if you've seen these Coast brand ones, they seem to be at, well, I got mine at everybody's favorite store, Crappy Tire. I mean, Canadian Tire. So, you know, it was another last minute Christmas purchase, I think. It was in the, it was on sale for maybe $39.99. Regular retails around $50. And that's, that's Canadian dollars, but that seems to be the price that it runs on for Amazon as well. And I'm sure you could get it cheaper at Home Depot. Now, as far as why I like this, number one, the strap, it's very adjustable, it's soft, but it stays where you want it to. I used to buy some at the dollar store and they were not very good. This one takes three AAA batteries. It came with Duracells. I'm going to haul these buggers out of here, throw them in my junk drawer so that I have extras and put my Anilupe rechargeables in here. Let's see. So you can, it's got lots of positive stops on there so you can put it up point it down, point it up without having to move your head, which I like. Waterproof rubber coated button there. Now I'm going to turn this on. It has three levels. It automatically comes on at the high level. One, high, medium, low, off. High, medium, low, off. Now it also has a focus so you can go wide light or narrow light, which I kind of like. Anyway, so Sorry for blinding you, but I want you to see how good this was. This is 615 lumens. For the price of it, it's as bright as I've been able to find for a headlamp. If you need a headlamp or you need four or five headlamps, <laughs> these do come in two packs as well, I've seen quite often. Um, fairly durable plastic. The lens itself I is either a really hard plastic or glass. I can't quite tell for sure. I think it's plastic, but it's really shiny. A single LED in there. And I'll bring it in a little closer so you can see. But there's your positive stops. You get your adjustable strap on the back end. Really soft. I like that. I know it is what it is. But let's put it on to be a geek here, hey? My kids always get a kick out of the headlamps when I put them on. But this has been one of the most comfortable ones I've had. Uh, it holds in place a lot better than some of the other ones. I know that's something pretty simple. But... I'm going to buy three more of these so that I have them in the house for when the power goes out and my kids and my wife all know where they are and they have one to wear. I mean, we have a generator to turn the power on, but 
when it happens, like I had to go to the basement to check on the furnace to make sure everything had shut down right. It was pitch dark down there, didn't have my generator up and running yet. This is awesome. Just having a headlamp that you can wear that frees up both hands to work while you're in the dark, that's all you need. So like I said, if you are looking for a headlamp that does the trick, this little Coast FL80 615 lumens is all you're going to need. So if you want to pick it up, you know where the link is in the description below. I would say it absolutely meets the Toolman Tim seal of approval. I like it so far. I'm going to test it some more. But for what it's worth, it seems to be a pretty decent quality. And if you like these videos and you want to see more of them, feel free to share it on whatever social platform you happen to use. And that's it for me for this week, guys. We'll see you next week. We'll see you on, let's see, what's day? Tuesday. We'll see you on Wednesday for another Tool Time Gear review. And as always, guys, stay happy, stay healthy, and have a great week.